episode of fishing here. So we're on Lake Ray Roberts and we're gonna go look for white bass. Thermocline's been going on, so the white bass have been scattered, not schooling well, so we're gonna look for that because we have a couple trips coming in the next couple of days. So uh, before we get started, kids, you gonna say us a prayer. Lord, just pray you're blessed today. Keep it safe on the boat. Uh, Lord, help us to find fish. And just thank you for the opportunity we have to enjoy your creation. Thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, let's go. Let's catch some fish. Good old windy day. The heat index was 108. Unbelievable. And then today, this morning, me and him get out here and it, it's got a nice breeze. It's beautiful. Of course, when I was fishing, my first cast, I caught a fish. So let's Come see. On. Let's see what happened. <laughs> I want you to notice that style, that wrist action, man. There this guy, this guy's got it. Another small. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Here it comes. Hey, that, that one's close. Uh, it's nine, under. Nine and a half. Right, yep. All right. Too small. Here we go. Yep. There we go. Still small. Got off. Quick release. But look, man, the water's boiling. They're bumping it, but these are all smalls. Speed up just a little bit. That's all we're catching.
big school of fish. Got another one. But they're all small fish. Another one. I love this TFO rod. The sensitivity of it, but strong. You ever get tired of catching fish? I don't think I ever get tired of catching fish. People say I'm angry at the fish because I want to catch all the fish. Hey, this is a lot nicer reel. You're, you've been holding that on me. Really, that's a pin reel. Yeah, that's a nice. And it's only like $49. Hey, that, boy, that's a, there we go. Here we go. That feels good. I think a little better. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, that, this one cast a lot better. Yeah, you were holding that on me. Oh yeah, there we go, right at the boat. Right, right at the boat. Yep. Yep. Why don't you bring one in? Because they're right here in front of you. Come on, fish. Boom, oh, there we go. There we go. That's a little bigger. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> He's there, a little small. That's how small he is. <laughs> All right. Yes, sir. Never gets old. Hooked it right on the bottom of the lip. Just perfect. Lip panther mark. Uh, single hook, easy to get off, perfect. Hey, I'm Kenny G. I, I fish with Ben Hicks, and we love what we do. Uh, a couple things I want to say. There's a perception that Christian men are kind of boring, and they don't get to have a good time, and, and, and that's just absolutely opposite. Uh, ben and I go out and fish. Uh, we have the best time ever. Uh, we we eat and we drink and we understand that uh, the beauty of this of the lake of nature uh, there's just other things that we we avoid that might get you in trouble so Christian men have a good time uh, they just may avoid some of those traps that Satan puts you into of alcoholism and, and all the other things that kind of trap you in that so just know that uh, when God says I want you to follow me and know me it's a good life, it's a pure life, it's a peaceful life, and there's a lot of joy in it. So let me give you the scripture today. John chapter 3, Jesus is talking to, uh, to Nicodemus. Now there was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews. The man named, uh, came to Jesus by night and said to him, Rabbi, we know that you are a teacher. Come from God, for no one can do these signs that you do unless God is with him. Jesus answered him, Truly, truly, I say to you, Unless one is born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. You know, uh, that's the beginning of everything that we do. Uh, if you don't have an understanding who Jesus Christ is, know that he's the son of God and believe in him and put your faith and trust in him. That's the start of all the wisdom. Most guys say, hey, I want to learn about the Bible. I want to get my life clean first. And then, then, then I want to turn around and, and get close to God. No, it's backwards. Catch, you catch it first just like a fish and then you clean it later. So just realize that Jesus said to Nicodemus, you must be born again. You must confess your sins. Uh, you must acknowledge Jesus as the Son of God and ask Him to come into your life. That's the beginning of everything. So that's kind of the pilot and the start of what we're doing. And that's our, that's our message throughout what we do here is that a man that knows Christ, that's his foundation, and then everything grows from there. So just know that you have to be plugged in you have to be some of your accountable too 
and uh, and go from there. So God bless you, Kenny G, Ben Hicks. You catch them, God service. GoPro, stop recording. <laughs> GoPro, stop recording. <laughs>